Hey guys, Flo here. So, um, welcome to my channel. Um, my name's Flo, and I'm 22 years old, and um, I live on the East Coast in the United States of America, and my top won't stay up. Okay, better. Um, so yeah, welcome to my channel. Basically, this channel is going to be um, made up of tags and things like room tours, and here's a text message. Sorry. Okay. Things like um, room tours and just helpful tips on how to keep things organized and clean and neat and things like that. So, so yeah, I hope you enjoy the videos that are coming later. Um, this is kind of just an introductory video explaining who I am and a little bit about me. Um, again, I'm Flo, as you can tell by the channel name. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go ahead and just show you guys some of the things that I'm interested in and kind of, you know, to help you get to know me. Um, one thing is the aromatherapy line at Bath & Body Works. Oh my gosh. Okay. So a lot of people say that these things don't work, like the stress reliever one doesn't really relieve really stress. It's kind of all in your head. I don't think I could care less. Um, they're, they smell good and they're cool to have. So, um, first of all, this is the pillow mist. Um, you're supposed to spray it on your pillow before bed so that it can kind of calm you down. Um, this is the lavender chamomile. OMG. And um, so, yeah, I actually spray it all over my bed and on the sheet and everything. So, sometimes all over my room. Um, so, yeah, there's that. And the candle, which is the um, sleep. Lavender Vanilla one, which, yes, so good. I don't think it's, I don't, I don't know. I personally usually go for, like, sweet smells, like um, cinnamon and sugary smells, um, cookies and things like that. But this smells really good, too, so I really like this one. And then I got the lotion here, which is the Lavender Vanilla, and the bath wash, body wash, is in my bathroom right now because I just used it actually the other day so yeah these things I love I also love the frosted cupcake candle from Bath and Body Works I didn't think that I would like this one for some reason I was like I'll just pick it up I actually went to go get the vanilla be noel one oh my gosh and um yeah and they were sold out are they sold out where you guys are the vanilla be noel candles I know that they have the little ones but I really wanted a big one like this and I can't find them any mall near me, so I'm hoping that they'll come back in stock, even though it's after Christmas. We'll see. But for the most, for um, for now, I like the Frosted Cupcakes handle. It smells really good. And the home, oops, uh oh, and the homemade cookies candle. There we go. And the homemade cookies candle. So. Yeah, these are the two that I'm liking right now. I also have the Moonlight Path one in my bathroom. I love that one. I love anything Moonlight Path and Sea Island Cotton, which used to be Cotton Blossom. I like them both, no matter what. They're cool. So yeah, those are a couple things. Um, some other things are these bracelets here, which um, I got from Forever 21 today. I got them in a pack. Actually, they came in all, with all these. And these were all in a pack. And these were all in a pack together, so um, I figure I don't need all of these on my arms. So I went ahead and just took a couple green and a couple pink and just kind of put them on and alternated them. But that's not working out right now. There we go. And just alternated them like this. So I also got this sweater from Forever 21 today too, which I love. I don't know. I've been really into um, been really into pearls lately. I don't know why. Not real ones, obviously, because these are fake. But you know what I mean. So yeah, I'm also really into organization. I think I've said that. Did I say that? Organization, um, storage, and just kind of cleanliness and things like that. So I really like these magazines, which are magazines that your grandmother would probably read or like your mom. But I really like these for some reason. Just kind of decorating ideas and... Um, storage ideas and organization and things like that. I just picked this one up today from CVS, so I'm excited to kind of look through it and see what's in it and, you know, things like that. So, uh, is there anything else? I don't know. This is a really random video, just kind of, well, it's not random. It's my first video, so it's not random. But just kind of explaining who I am and 
um, just a little bit about me in case you're interested and yeah oh okay so I picked this up from CVS today it's, the, it's this what's it called sachet vite I think it's what it's called right a top coat so I had okay so I went to CVS a long time ago maybe like a few weeks ago and went to go pick this up and so I found it and I went home and I'm like yay I'm so happy I got this you know so I started using it you know it's a top coat on my nails then what two days ago my sister is trying to borrow some my top coat and my nail polish so she's in my nail polish she's sticking through and she's like where's your top coat I'm like it's in there she's like no it's not I don't see it and I'm like okay let me go look so I go and I'm like it's right here and she goes this is the base coat it says base coat right there and I was like so I've been using it as a top coat this whole time like I thought this was the top coat <laughs> she's like it's a base coat so I went today and I finally got the top coat and now I use the base coat as a base coat not as a top coat Honestly, I don't, they're not that much different. It's not like it's the end of the world, but I just thought, you know, I spent that much money. Because, you know, these are like, the base coat's like $7 and the top coat's like $9. So, honestly, for that much money for a nail polish, you better be getting the right one and not wasting your time or wasting your money on the wrong thing. Anyway, so yeah, that's what I did. I went to Forever 21 and CVS and a couple other places. Auntie Anne's. Is there an Auntie Anne's all over the country? Because there should be. Like, this place is amazing. Like, every time I go to the mall, I get Auntie Anne's. This is the mango lemonade um, juice. You can get it frozen, too, like a sherbet, like sherbet, um, smoothie, icy kind of thing, but, yeah. I also got for Christmas, well, actually, this is, I didn't get this for Christmas. What you're, what I'm filming on right now, I got that for Christmas. It's a flip camera. It's so cute too. It has like, it's blue and it has like daisies on it. Anyway, for my birthday, I got the iPod Touch with my name engraved. And it says 2010 from my sister. Amazing. And she got me this flip for Christmas too. Anyway, so yeah, I'm loving it. It's so cool. And I love how, oops, I don't know. Oh. This is a Sierra music video. Oh. Okay, so the song, <laughs> the song is called Promise Ring by Tiffany Evans. It's really old. It's from like a couple years ago. OMG, is this bothering you as much as it's bothering me? Like, you know, I feel like when I watch YouTube gurus and, and other people's videos and they keep touching their hair over and over again or they'll like touch something on their body over and over and over again it kind of starts to bother you and you start to pay more attention to that than what they're actually saying is that is that what's happening right now like when I do this is that annoying I'm sure it is because it's annoying me I'm sorry I don't know I'm not one of those people that touch my hair all the time so that's a plus but anyway um I love this song can you hear it There we go. Anyway, you guys should go look up that song. It's Tiffany Evans, Promise Ring, and Sierra. Oh my gosh. Sierra is in it too, and it's really good. I love that song. Anyway, so that's just an introductory video, just kind of explaining who I am. Um, my next video will most likely be a room tour because I feel like that is one of the videos that if you watch it, you kind of get a really good idea of who the people are, who that person is and their style and what they like and things like that. So the next one will probably be a room tour. My room isn't great. My room isn't cute like all those other rooms, just to warn you. But just, I don't know. I don't think your room has to be super cute for you to do a room tour. I feel like they're fun to watch, you know no matter who you are and fun to make so I encourage people to make room tour videos even if they don't think they're as cute or whatever I, I mean I like watching them most of the time not not because they're like amazing rooms and they have all this expensive stuff it's because I feel like 
it's fun just to kind of see what other people's homes are like. They don't have to be super nice rooms. It's just kind of nice to see, you know, oh, well, she does that in her room, so do I, or she gets that in her room, so do I. I found a couple room tours the people have the exact same day bed that I do, that I sleep on, so I was kind of excited. I was like, oh, someone else has this, because I didn't know anyone else that had the day bed that I got. And even though, I guess it's kind of a popular one, I got it from Ikea. So, anyway. <laughs> Um, yeah, so I'm going to do a room tour next. I'm going to do a lot of those tag videos and um, it kind of that get to know you type videos and things like that. So, um, and just kind of whatever else comes to mind because I don't, I don't, I don't have like a specific, you know, I don't, I'm glad that I'm not put in a box with this channel. Like it's not a beauty channel, so I can only talk about beauty related things. Um, it's just a whatever comes to mind channel. So if you're interested, subscribe, and if not, that's okay. This is, this would just be kind of for me then. But I, but I want you to subscribe, okay, because I have cool stuff coming up. Anyway, thanks for watching, and, um, I hope you guys have a great day, and I hope that I did well introducing myself and the things I like and things like that. Alright, have a good one. Bye.